after Nitish Kumar's flip to the BJP, put the Mahagadbandan in opposition. Former Deputy CM Tejasvi Yadav has brought his Jan Vishwas Yatra across Bihar to the capital city of Patna, where he gathered all his allies for a Ma rally. Now, this rally was attended by RJD Chief Lalu Yadav, Congress President Malika Jun Kharge, and MP Rahul Gandhi, Samajwadi Party Chief Akhilesh Yadav, leaders from the left front like Sitaram Yachuri and D Raja, as well as various other leaders of the opposition in Bihar and pulled a massive attendance to the Gandhi Maidan in Patna. The leaders took turns in addressing the massive gathering and made it clear that the first aim of the opposition is to rid the country of the BJP and RSS. Key poll issues like unemployment and housing were also raised and points were made to counter the NDA's rally in Begu Sarai, which took place yesterday. <laughs> हम कहना चाहते हैं माई के साथ साथ बाप की भी पार्टी है ये माई बाप की पार्टी है बी से बहुजन ए से अगला दूसरे ए से आधी आबादी महिला और पी से पुअर बिहार जैसा राज एक से एक यहाँ पर बेड एक से एक सुरमा यहाँ पैदा लिए बिहार में इसी गांधी मैदान में बिहार की हवा में दम है कि जो बिहार फैसला लेता है वही देश के लोग अनुकरण करते हैं देश में जब भी बदलाव आता है वो बिहार में तूफान शुरू होता है यहां से तूफान बाकी प्रदेशों में जाता है यह बिहार जो है देश की राजनीति का नर्व सेंटर है तीसरी बात आज इंडिया गठबंधन बीजेपी का मुकाबला कर रही मोदी का मुकाबला कर रही जब तक आप मोदी को नहीं हटाएंगे इस देश में सुख और समृद्धि नहीं रहेंगी अगर उत्तर प्रदेश अस्सी हराओं का नारा दे रहा है तो बिहार भी पीछे नहीं है चालीस हराओं का नारा यहां से भी निकल करके जा रहा है Kuntal Krishna, BJP spokesperson, is joining us live. We also have Vikram Sandhu, Congress spokesperson, joining us on the broadcast. Mayank Sinha, senior leader of the JDU, is live with us. Dr. G.B.R. Shastri, political analyst, is also uh, joining us live. Let me uh, begin with you first, uh, uh, Kuntal Krishna. Clearly, uh, the opposition in Bihar taking an opportunity to hit out at the NDA, to uh, reply to PM Modi, to reply to the BJP leaders uh, who... Uh, uh, attacked the opposition in Begu Sarai yesterday. What do you make of this rally, the turnout, and the attacks on BJP and Narendra Modi? This was not at all a political rally. It was a gathering of hooligans. It was a gathering of gathering of mafia and their supporters. And this gathering was on the call of Lalu Prashad Yadav, Tejashwi Prashad Yadav, and RJD. Bihar has decided what to do. Bihar has rejected Mafia Raj. Bihar has rejected dynastic politics of corruption. Bihar has rejected Gunda Raj. And Bihar has embraced Ram Raj. Bihar is going to give 40 seats to the target of 400 par. Ab ki baar 400 par aur usme se 40 dega Bihar. This is what Bihar has decided. Bihar has decided to develop itself with BJP and allies. So whatever was there today on the streets of Patna is a showcase what RJD and Lalu family will do to Bihar when it comes to power. Okay, uh, let me uh, get in a response to Mikram Sandhu. Mikram Sandhu, uh, uh, it was a gathering of hooligans, not politicians, says uh, the BJP. Your response, and Mikram Sandhu, uh, uh, you know what are the reports that you have got from how successful today's rally was? in Patna. Odeji, uh, using words like hooligan is the prerogative of the BJP and they can use them. Even our political opponents, we don't call them hooligans, though they behave like that. But still, they are our political rivals and we give them that respect. But expecting respect from BJP, I think so, is asking for a bit too much. So I'll just leave it at that. As far as this rally is concerned, the feedback that I have got is that it was a stupendous success. 
the you know turnout was measuring into lakhs and lakhs and that augurs really well for our mahagathbandhan in uh, bihar and the whole india alliance on a pan india basis it shows that people are sick and tired of the false promises the false narrative and the non issues that the bjp keeps on raising you know there is social strife there is political strife there is economic strife nobody is talking about that but non issues will be brought up and people have given enough time to mr modi and his government 10 years is a long enough time and they have realized that we have to vote for a change if we want jobs we have to change if we want economic growth we have to change if we want social equilibrium society where a brother go gets along with a brother we have to vote for change and if we want clean politics where you know right from the councilor to the mlas are not to be bought on the basis of you know income tax cbi ed or money power then we have to get rid of bjp and get back to a semblance of decorum which was there uh, before bjp came and really has run rough shot on our political social and economic traditions okay uh, mayank sena let me uh, quickly draw you in here this was obviously an opportunity uh, also for the first time Mang, can you hear me? Okay, I think we've lost. Yeah, Mang I hear Sinade. you. I think we've lost Mang Sinade. Uh, G. V. R. Shastri, let me try and rope you in if you can hear me on uh, what you make of uh, you know the kind of attacks today that we've heard from the opposition on the B. J. P. on the Prime Minister Modi. It was their poll pitch, but did we get an uh, understanding of the issues at hand or just personal attacks? See, the yeah, as uh, Mr. Sandhu said, you know, because it's a important that we are saying every time the opposition party is saying but they are not standing on that see you are what is exactly you are addressing why you are addressing mr modi what is mr modi why you are addressing bjp you address the issues of the people why you are addressing bjp what for you are you have a strength opposition party you have a strength if you think that you have a strength you address that you are not addressing that you are not standing on that your leaders are not standing on that whether rahul gandhi or maybe anybody for that fact development and upliftment let us talk about the development and upliftment are you able to talk or not talk on that 10 years two terms um, power has been given to people of the nation towards the bjp are you not understanding that you are not in the issue so better let us say that for example that bjp is not in issue is no problem they are in power throw them out but you are not you are not capable of doing it you are not capable of representing the people of the nation you are not representing it you are talking about it development and upliftment of the people let us talk about the issues what is that malikarjun karge is addressing the gathering what is he was saying jab tak modi hai modi means modi is miss modi Five years term is a fifteen hundred, sixteen hundred days. You address your party. Your party rules the states. You remember, Mr. Sandhu, that N. T. Ramarao is with two hundred and twenty-four MLAs. He has been thrown out out of the government in five minutes' time by Sir Wilson Francis of Indira Gandhi. Is it not in done in your government? It is in your government and your party. Congress is not responsible for that. What are you talking? what kind of who 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 shown this legacy who shown this path towards the entire as uh, a political politicizing the entire thing in this country you are the main guiding force 100 years 100 years of party you have a responsibility a leadership means sacrifice a leadership means sacrifice what sacrifice you are doing you can't even represent the people of the nation You see what kind of language Mr. Malikarjun Khadge is using again as a, a prime minister. After he is the prime minister of this nation, Mr. Modi, whatever you say, he is the prime minister of this nation, accepted prime minister of this nation. Max, majority of the people have accepted him. You respect him. You criticize his policies. You criticize his policies of the government. But why you are targeting the individual? Individual target is not required. If Modi didn't done anything, no problem. You address him. You address the nation. You address the people. You address the core issues of the people. 
farmers is an issue electricity is an issue energy resource is an issue human resource is an issue natural resource is an issue income is an issue revenue is an issue taxes are is an issue everything buniyadi taur pe everything is an issue health education transportation communication is an issue you are not talking about any one word as a opposition leader malikarjun has raised any of this must i must tell you mr sandhu let it be clear today the country is really great it is an at least i can say this 150 rupees 160 rupees petrol hona chahiye 100 rupees mein tha it is in 100 100 rupees nearly at least that way we done so acknowledge it acknowledge the government and ensure that you criticize them left right center but not individual target that is not received by the people of the nation be clear on it be clear on it you don't have a strength to you exhibit exhibit your strengths explain to the nation what is your strength you are not able to do that that is what as a you know i felt as a core uh, this thing an intellectual i felt so i couldn't understand the kind of language very professional language should come from the uh, you know uh, in the leadership high leadership of the congress party you please reach the communication the power of speech yes modi understand the power of speech and communication nobody understands let it be clear on he reached the people man of this nation whatever you say that he reached well versed please understand this language i know i don't agree with that krishna has said the uh, gun Bundas, but that is not correct. But at the same time, please, please remember, Mr. So Modi is not correct. May I come in, please? Yes, Ikram. Yeah, you know, uh, thanks a lot for your concern about what my leaders raised and what they did not raise. I'll just like to remind you what BJP used to say. Hmm. when mr manmohan singh was the prime minister you used to call him mon mohan singh. I, show me one clipping where you have opposed that. Wasn't that a personal attack? when mr modi called sonia gandhi a jersey cow while upa was in power wasn't that a personal attack when he called raji uh, rahul gandhi a hybrid bachra was yeah. not that a personal attack so don't give me that that it is kosher if bjp and mr modi say something that yeah. makes him a great communicator but if the congress uh, pays them back in the same coin it is no 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 some red line has been crossed and personal attacks cannot mean it and what is personal attack in this government everything is mr modi it is not bjp ki guarantee it is modi ah, ki guarantee no so if if but, a person no no sir no. you Sorry, say, your, I I did not no, no. now that i am speaking have the decency to hear me out please have that decency you you went on and on i did not interrupt you so when mr modi has made everything personal the attack also has to be personal and of course we are raising our issues what is mr rahul gandhi raising he is raising issues of youth he is using issues of women he is you are uh, raising issues of kisan he is using uh, raising issues of the backward all these issues are being raised by us but the fountain head of this government the fountain head of evil that this government is mr modi represents that as the prime ministership and in india where we have a westminster style of government the prime minister is first among equals he is the first among equals as far as the cabinet is concerned and if an attack has to be launched it is always on the prime minister and it is not just for india you take british uh, no. parliament you take the french parliament anywhere else the leader always has to bear the brunt so don't give them the teflon coating that you want to give mr modi that no 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 you cannot say anything to mr modi mr modi says everything and anything to anybody he should have the gumption to hear when other people say the same things about him that is all the point i have to say and the issues as far as there we know what the issues are we are raising those issues and it is on those issues that we are telling the people that you have given mr modi 10 years and he has failed miserably on all these issues now give us a chance and in these 5 years we'll show to you how social problems can be resolved how political problems can be resolved how economic problems can be resolved and we always say that there is a there's a comparison the 10 years of upa government where we gave a 8% growth of gdp versus the 5.9% that you've got in uh 10 years of mr modi the bhaichara that you had in our 10 years to the bhaichara that you have today the 10 years that we had where opposition parties opposition mlas were not bought threatened cajoled imprisoned to break governments 
everybody Sir, finished in Rome in our 10 years, which doesn't happen now under Mr. Modi. And oh. this has to be Okay, changed. let's allow Kuntal Krishna now a chance to respond of the BJP. Yes, uh, GBR, yeah. I'll come to you. We were talking about today's rally. With all due regards to Mr. Sandhu. Mr. Sandhu, let me tell you, neither political activists like you were invited, nor were you there. Let me give you some factual position. You know, last night, for whole of the night, hmm. bar girls were forced to dance on burger songs in RJD camps. Come on, does, is this, you the, this, is this you the kind with, of you do on with, your channel? With Come any, on, any political yeah. rally, Mr. Uh, Sandhu? Does Come you on, do I can with say any so many things rally? about you. They, there was no, this was not at all a rally of if political something you can talk on, on it what was we a said in our what rally, said, rally, what I, show me a clipping where these barbells are dancing. You are just Sandu, raising issues without Sandu, any proof. The it's all that BJP can please do. Listen to me. I am listening to you, but what you are saying is so... Now you please listen to me. But did I say something like this? The barbells were dancing in Begusra yesterday? You tell me, you know of any rally? Where the people coming for the rally are entertained with vulgar songs and dances? You know of any political come rally? Come on, come on, have this some is, decorum this is what in what happened you are saying. In the what is hello, it? Hello. Show me the clipping. We are setting on this channel. Show me the clipping. Uh, can you hear me? Our girls were dancing and people were entertained. Come on, NewsX is a responsible channel. No myths cannot be spread on your channel. Come on, okay, don't let this cannot be spread on your channel. This is just cannot, nothing else. Okay, let's come back to the issue now. Let's come back to the issue now. Let's come back to the rally and the politics and counter politics. How the crowd was there or not that's a separate issue uh, because it was a big crowd of course the, 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 the you know the government will say that these crowd not necessarily, not necessarily will translate into votes but there was a big crowd Kuntal Krishna let's come back to the issue at hand and the points versus counterpoints of the rally uh, that were made do you believe the issues that were raised today are resonating with the public or is this just mere rhetoric Kuntal Krishna opposition does not have any issue to raise they are not having any issue to raise. Opposition is only counting on one issue, and that is, since Mr. Narendra Modi is against corruption, against dynastic politics, all the dynasts who are deep into corruption have united together. That's all. Opposition does not have any issue to raise. They are simply raising their fingers on one individual who is against corruption, who is against dynastic politics. Yes. Ikra. You know, first I'll have to take that bar girl dancing. Uh, Kundanji, please don't raise such issues which demean you and it your is party. A fact, this sir, is just it a is brother. A show me sir, the clipping. Show me the clipping. Show me it the clipping. Fact, if you are just sitting here, show me the clipping. Let sir, us not talk please, in you and please, no Google, when we don't please, have proof. Google, I can say please, 20 Google, things sir. about your leaders. Sir, please, I can Google. say 20 things about you your leaders, but if I don't have proof, it is as a responsible spokesperson, I will not say a thing. You cannot do a hit job sir, that you say a thing for, for which you have no proof. No, sir, this you is are wrong. For this Mar is Mar wrong. Mar you, you are I'm acting in the. I'm sorry to say, it's a very juvenile way in which you are acting when you are please saying something reality, for which sir. you have no proof. Do not say sir, something which you cannot prove you with either an audio or a visual recording. How can you say such a thing? How can you say such a thing? This is just being very, very immature on your part. This, that's sir, all I like sir, to say. Here. I'm, I'm sorry to say. And, please know and, the reality. Please know I the know reality. all the realities, you brother. I know the realities. Do not you give me lies and half baked lies and untold to prove a point. Throughout the night. You please have your government. Reality. You have your government this in the reality, Why sir. don't you? Why didn't you video record it and uh, uh, launch an FIR sir, under there, the relevant sections please, of vulgarity? Please the time and just have a look at this. It is you there, tell sir. me, you have a government in Bihar, your CM, your deputy CM, the home ministry in sir, Bihar is will, under you. Why have you not sir, launched sorry. an FIR sir, will, against RJD? Why haven't you done it? Sir, we uh, are, we are so, taking appropriate action. So tell no me, sorry. let's... Uh, Udeji, so call us again tomorrow, call us again tomorrow, call both of us and then we'll see whether they have taken any action. 
This is Sir, classic we, BJP. We this is classic action. BJP. You have nothing. आप एक शगुफा छोड़ देंगे कि ये हो गया जिसके बारे में आपके पास कोई प्रूफ नहीं है और आप तो भी हम करेंगे हम करेंगे क्या क्या आपने आपकी गवर्नमेंट है आपकी नीचे है होम मिनिस्ट्री आप एक्शन लीजिए दे आर प्रोविजन गारंटी टेक एक्शन अरेस्ट पीपल This is a golden opportunity you have. अगर आपके पास ये है, आप ये शो कीजिए कि आपकी जनता को कि आपके लिए ने क्या किया, कांग्रेस ने क्या किया, इंडिया ने क्या किया। If not, don't have been done. से ये तो आपके फैले की बात है। आप क्यों नहीं इसे दिखा रहे? आप सर बोली क्यों रहे? आप दिखाइए इसे। आप एफएयर लॉन्ग। जीवित शास्त्री आदि। चलिए, चलिए ये डिबेट मैंने एक सेकंड, एक सेकंड। आप मैं आप दोनों को रोकूंगा क्योंकि आप दोनों ही साइड ट्रैक हो गए। एकरम संधु आपने कहा था ये डिबेट बार डांसर्स पे नहीं होना चाहिए। आप ही, Let's talk no. now once again no. about no. the issues. No. Uh, Jivya Shastri, Bihar, you know, was thought to be, a, a, you know, a state where there would be a tight fight this time around. But do you believe now with the JDU realignment that the fight is still tough or it's become, uh, has it swung towards the NDA? Does it still remain tough or has it swung towards the NDA with the realignment in Bihar? Obviously, today's opposition ra rally was a show of strength, trying to say that it's still going to be a tough fight. That the opposition has a very good chance in Lok Sabha and Bihar, but is that correct or not? What is your assessment, J.V. Ashasri? This success, the success of democracy is that you know they should get strength. The opposition parties must be in strength. They should know what to do exactly, how to take up the issues and uh, issues and the problems of the people of the state and as well as in the nation. Here I have said only that you know opposition. Party should not criticize Prime Minister. No, I have not said that. Criticizing personal thing, criticize him left, right, center on the policies. Criticize BJP left, right, center on policies. Not the language, you know, there is no need to refer Prime Minister Modi. You refer Prime Minister, you have done this, this is the go, your government has done like this. Again, uh, line down everything. What is who is stopping you to take up that? Mangai, you can talk about the, the cost of living of the common man, common man purchasing power, water, anything you talk. Let the government to reply on it. My friend Krishna should reply on it. But you don't have any facts in your hand. You are missing very important, Mr. Sandhu. You don't have any facts in your hand. What are the facts you have? You tell me. What fact you want to talk? Which figure you want to talk? You remember one thing, this is a mixed economy country, ruled by your, your, your prime ministers, till the prime minister P. V. Narasura came into the power. He was the man who has turned around the entire thing, and after that, Manmohan Singh. After that, Manmohan Singh. You let us talk about the figures, let us discuss. Now we are in, we are in the live and the entire nation is watching us. Yes. Yes. You can respond, Ikram, and then GBR can counter you. Yes. I'm running out of time. Let's have a count. So, Mr. Shastri, just to raise a point, you said that fuel should be 150 today. That shows you know what you are talking about. Yes, I am telling. No, I want to counter it because I am telling you very clearly. Let me not finish. 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 Let me not Yes, tell me, you me tell me what is the central no, excise you. You on fuel no, today no, and what was the, the central no, excise no. on fuel See, when UPA was in power. Give me that figure, Mr. Shastri. I challenge you to give that figure. You regard time on diesel, central excise was 3 rupees 65 pesa. Today, the central excise on fuel is 31 rupees. It's a shame on that government that you have to increase it by 28 rupees. No, let to me hear me out. To, uh, get your, uh, uh, you know, to, to uh, balance your budget. You need to hear me out. You, you are hearing me out. 
You Shastra raised the Bula. point of 150. I am answering you on that. Have, have the gumption to hear me out. You don't have the gumption. You are just a surrogate of this government. That is all you have. You are a BJP economist. Nothing more, nothing less. You don't know. What did Congress jeopardize? You tell me. What did Congress jeopardize? Everything has been jeopardized by this government. You have patience to listen me. You don't have the patience to listen. You raised something on fuel. Let me answer on that. I will count five points. I'll count five okay, okay, we've run out of time. Point versus counter counterpoint will, of course, continue. The voters will have their last say. Uh, political pitches are going to now uh, rise with each passing day as we get closer and closer to the looks of elections for the time being. We've run completely out of time. My thanks to all of our guests. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon.